Welcome back everybody to a Rodenberg Rocks video. We are here on a lightly snowing and wavy day. Um, I know some of my last videos have been obnoxious with the waves so I apologize. Again, I have not invested in any equipment yet to, to muffle the sound, so maybe like the microphone here, thanks to my fiance giving me that idea um, to maybe hold my voice closer so you don't catch the wave sound as much. So uh, I'm gonna do my best if it's bad throughout the video. I'll probably muffle it and try and be quieter or just muffle the sound because I know it's loud and obnoxious on other people end. But I came here because it's after a big, big, day of waves from November 10th, the anniversary of Edmund Fitzgerald. So I figured a lot of new rocks were turned up and I thought I'd come to a prime spot to, to see if we'd find any. So thanks for taking along in the video and we'll, we'll see you throughout it. Well, we are here after the big storm of November 10th, I believe. The anniversary of Edmund Fitzgerald. So you might see there's a boat way out there. But I wanted to come especially to a beach freshly after a big storm because we knew lots of rocks were going to show up. I've already found some rocks. I'll show you in a little bit. But I think I just found such a great one. And you can just see the physical bands right away on this one. This beautiful, oh my goodness, look at how defined those characteristics are. But we're gonna make our way down this whole shoreline, you know, with all these waves pushing all the way up to my feet, and see if we uncover some beauties like this. Here's a few of the finds we've already found. Again, I'll, I'll wash them off and show you them at home because I think today is gonna be a good day. We started just like right here this beach, this third little inlet. Um, we're gonna make our way down and see what we find. Okay, again, I am so sorry for the sound of the waves, but you guys are about to be blown away by this egg, and I just, I just looked at it. Holy smokes. Look at the bands on this sucker. Oh my goodness. This is what the new waves bring to, to light every so often. Oh my gosh. That is just absolutely gorgeous. Sorry, I'm just trying to get the best light. Wow, those bands are just amazing. <laughs> Again, I'm just speechless. Wow. All right, that just made the whole hunt worth it, but we still got a long way to go. Initially, this rock caught my eye. Nothing, but then I looked underneath this rock, saw a little bit of a glower. Wow, that is stunning. I love that defined white band. Oh my goodness. What a great hunt so far. Looks like we got a couple right next to each other. Looks like, well, I thought this one was originally. Might just be a piece of chert. But mostly this one caught my eye. Oh, holy, okay. The big one is sweet, but the red banding in this one. Oh my goodness, and hints of blue. Okay, this one is just beautiful. There's, there's, there's some good light of it. Wow. Whew. What a blessed hunt. This is so wonderful. This is what rock hunting and egg hunting is all about. It just gets me so giddy every time. <laughs> Let's go. Well, the sun's starting to come out and it honestly is helping me a bit. Just beautiful water level. Just a little window there. It's gorgeous. 
This one's just placed so beautifully. A lot of quartz in this one. Right down the middle, but still very, very beautiful outer layer and translucent. A couple little bands in there, but still what a great find. I just really should just keep recording and then really catch my live reactions to these because man they are all over the place. It's like this doesn't even feel real. Oh I love that little white pocket band right there. Absolutely fascinating. This is just again, not to not to say I always come to the same beach, but this beach out of any that gives me the best best of luck. As many of you know, my favorite part is looking at these clay deposits to see what sparks new. At least all the waves and the sun. So we got a nice, nice nodule here. Absolutely stunning. I just love them. You never know when they're here or when they'll pop out. When they do, they fall right next to it. Clearly not just... Oh boy. <laughs> as long as it doesn't fade away. Oh no. Oh, I just saw a large agate in this area. I lost it. Was it this guy? No. Oh, this is what, that's what I get for not recording and having to use right here. That's a beautiful one. That's still not it. I am a... Give me a moment and I'll find it. I was a little worried I found it. But this is like the definition of a water banded level A. Yet. Look at how perfect that is. Absolutely gorgeous. Glad I found it. That's what I get. I'm playing a dangerous game. Playing, playing in the water, too close to the water. But you gotta do what you gotta do sometimes. Okay, this one I have not seen at all, but I see a little, little thing here and out being from the sun. And I'm not sure what that is. Definitely not an egg to tell, but it definitely looks like it. Oh well, it doesn't hurt that I don't, this is not one compared to everything else I found. But. Oh well. Oh wait, on the other hand, uh, right as I toss that down, this one is for sure an egg. Holy, oh, look at those beautiful lines up top here. Gorgeous. All right, here's, here's a fun one. Wow, that one's beautiful too. Oh, wow, there's some nice lime that's All right, not quite sure what this is, but it's very beautiful. Anyone have any idea what that is? Is that just like a straight up piece of amethyst? That is, and you know, that looks like egg the outside. Interesting. Taking it home for sure though. Can't tell if this is one yet, but it kind of looks like it. Looks like it's older. Oh, that most, that, wow. That's a very smooth and polished portion of it, but it's definitely a wonderful egg. It, there's some fine, finer bands in there. You can kind of see the indentation, but not not getting too much light right now. I will show you back home. But wonderful. On our way back now and finding some pieces that we didn't see on the initial go around. Very nice, nice, very nice. Some light white banding with some quartz and yeah. Like the waves are just touching so far up. So you can, it helps a lot right now to see agates reflecting the sunlight. Oh 
Oh boy. Not a lot of visual banding, but this is a clear, clear agate. It's absolutely gorgeous. Wow. Such a spoiled hunt today. Getting close to the end here. Um, thought I saw a couple. Yeah, this one is weird. I saw this, I was like, is that a band? I don't know if that's an agate. Whoa, what the heck? Dude, that is a strange, strange agate. What the heck? That is really cool. I don't, again, never seen an agate like this before. What? I just saw this and I was like, it kind of looks like banding, but I've seen a lot of quartz with these little red lines on it. But... Wow, that is really unique. Very, very cool. At the end of the beach, getting pretty close to call it. Just calling it a day. I'm heading up this rock hill that I did to, to come down to the beach. Um, such an amazing hunt. I do not understand why I become so blessed to have all these great hunts, but I'm not complaining. Um, but I'm excited to go through all the finds because I didn't record them all, honestly. I didn't record quite a bit of them because more and more kept popping up. So we're gonna go back, lay out all the rocks and show you all the finds we found. So we'll see you here shortly. Well, we made it back and I'm so excited to show you guys all the finds that we found. I have them displayed here along with some nice sea glass, which I'm always happy to pick up. So without further ado, let's see everything that we found. So here is everything we found. A little itty bits of sea glass, as well as some nice agates, some nice jasper, maybe even a big piece of amethyst there. So I'm excited to do a close up. Again, obviously there's a lot of them. So I'm just gonna at this point stop talking and then cut to show all of them close up.
Well, that's going to wrap it up for another Rodenberg Rocks video. Thanks for tagging along for <laughs> tagging along for such an amazing hunt and just sticking with me throughout this channel so far as we continue to grow and learn together. So we'll see you next video and thanks for watching.